Hey, here's some cool software I found. It's called Zen Coding or Zen Code. It's a sweet little plugin. You can add it to multiple IDEs or whatever. I'm using it personally on Genie because that's my favorite IDE slash text editor. Um, what you can do if you just want to generate like a doc type or something like that, you can do something like this and it'll generate the whole thing for you. Once you're done with that, if you want to generate like some like linking CSS or something, you don't have to type the whole thing out, you can just go like that and then fill that one field out. On top of that, you can also do things like make tables or whatever you want to do. So if you want like four rows or and then three columns or something like that, you can do something like this and then it'll generate the whole thing for you. If you want to wrap it, you can do that too. So you can do a control Q and then uh, type whatever you want the abbreviation. So I'm, I'm going to just add an ID, so I'll call it my ID, and then I'll actually wrap the whole thing for you. I prefer if it looked like that. Um, and on top of that, let's say you want to make some type of radio buttons or something. What you can do is you can say input, and then you can say radio. And then let's say we wanted uh, the value to change. So value is equal to that. And then we want the group name to all be the same. So we'll call it group group one or something like that. And then on top of that we'll multiply by four because we want four of them. And then it will generate all of those for us. And as you can see they have ID blah blah blah. Which is uh, pretty nice. So those are some of the basic things you can do. You can also do like nesting and a couple other things, but this is some basic stuff. If you just want like one tag, you can do that. Uh, if you want like a, a class on it, you can do that too. If you want like a dot, I don't know. Sounds good enough. If you want to go back fields, you can actually do that. So that's how you do that. It's, it's a pretty cool plugin. So I covered how to like make inputs and you can actually increment all of these by using that little uh, dollar symbol. You can make classes using like the CSS type of syntax. You can do nested type stuff like like this, tables. There's actually a short and if you want. So, and that's only going to generate one, but it still generates the whole thing for you. So yeah, this is a nice little plugin. I thought. So I, I just generated that without doing like any of it manually, so it's pretty nice. I can render it out to a page or whatever. Since I didn't actually put any stuff in any of the cells, that was kind of pointless. But if I wanted to I could. I could be like a table TR times four times three and then all and all the TDs I want like I don't know just the dollar thing. And I can uh, render all that out for me. So that, that's the basics of Zen coding. Uh, it's a really nice little plugin to have. You can do a lot more than just that, but that's, that's what I've done so far, and it's pretty cool to play around with. Peace.